Here we go. Welcome back. It is 825 and let's it's time for our pet of the week segment, ladies and gentlemen. And joining us today is Debbie and Gwen from Doberman Underground. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you very much for have, having us. Introduce us to who we have here. Well, so we have Machi here. Machi, can you turn around like everybody's face? <laughs> so Machi. She's a good girl. Uh, Machi yeah. came up from Georgia. Okay. Oh. Um, she was found tied to a tree. Oh, um, oh my and, goodness. And uh, Machi looked like this. The ears, uh, her, she's missing her ears, if everybody can see that on her. And uh, that was because uh, somebody did a poor taping job and, and probably ear cutting. And yeah. I'm, I'm going to guess they probably did this at home yeah. themselves um, because she still has her tail. So mm. that's very unusual in a Doberman breed to have your be an all natural with the tail, but sure. then somebody cropped the ears. Mm. So this is the result of what happens when somebody is not properly informed of how to actually tape and care for those ears when they crop them. Yeah. Um, so Machi's here though with us and now she's uh, she's looking for her her forever home and to have that back story She's such yeah. a yeah. Yeah, she, she is she is such a sweetheart very good I mean she's and she's she's got a beautiful uh, she's got a very statuesque um, build to her mm -hmm. very athletic um, So she is you know would be great for a runner for somebody doing agility any of those many things I mean she's and she's just beautiful looking. She yeah, really she is yeah. a beautiful beautiful dog And so you said that she will be good for an active family or uh, yes. person. Yes, what about kids? Um, Debbie? Like eight or older because she's so big and strong. Sure. Mm -hmm. Tyler, yeah. she could knock down easily. And, and she, other dogs? Um, uh, yeah, she'd do great with another dog. Male okay. probably preferably because she does, I mean, not, not that she's not good with females, but just because she likes the way she plays. She's a little, she's still puppyish where she's kind of rough playing sure. and wants to, mm. a little tomboyish. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Why not? yeah. And, and Debbie, you've actually taken um, uh, Machi in for the past few weeks. Tell me a little bit about uh, just her personality, if you don't mind, just real quick. Oh, she's really good. Um, she does love to watch TV. Yeah. <laughs> she barks at the pet of she, the week that I, I we hear. Yeah. She barks at all the dogs she sees. Yeah. Um, she gets along with my dogs real good. She's Fantastic. A great snuggler, sleeping. Yeah. And I've, you all have an event coming up. We do. It's called Bark Bingo. Um, so that's Bark a, Bingo. Bark that's Bingo. Great. Yes. <laughs> yes. That will be on uh, April 23rd at uh, Solon Community Center in Solon, Ohio. Um, it is uh, the prizes are bags and booze, so or bags and bourbon, really. Mm -hmm. uh, so we have everything from a bottle of Blanton's bourbon for one of the top prizes wow. if you're a bourbon drinker. Absolutely. Um, yeah. A lot of the Buffalo Trace line we have there, and then we have, of course, all the favorite purses. Michael Kors and Kate Spade and Coach are going to be there for prizes as well. So all the money is going to help us raise money to help care for these dogs because we just took in over uh, 30 dogs. Wow. Uh, from a, rest, a breeder in Georgia that was arrested. So oh. um, we have every type of dog right now. We have Great Danes to down to little uh, terriers, Dobermans, mixes, everything yeah. going on. So come on out and come adopt out. as yes. well and support this and organization. And also get some whiskey while you're at it. <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, thank you so much for being here today, mm -hmm. and we're going to be back right after these messages. Stick with